Hi everyone, I have a few things to show you today. Um, I'm going to start off with um, a pair of shoes actually. Um, and these I got from very.co.uk but they do sell them on, I saw them on shoe and they had different colours and designs and things. Um, and they're just a pair of Converse um, All Stars something or other. Anyway, um, <laughs> they're the navy blue, um, white and they got like red on them. Um, so I got those from very.co.uk um, and um, I got some candles as well. The first one I'm going to show you I actually got from eBay um, and this is a Slatkin & Co which is from Bath & Body Works candle. It's one of the big three wick ones and this one is um, Winter Garland and I got this one specifically for Christmas. Um, it smells quite nice. It has um, if you like the small cranberries, um, I do have a small one which I didn't bring in but I'm going to show you the big one of Cranberry Woods and that was the first scent I got um, and I absolutely love it and this one's sort of along that scent of cranberries but it's also got um, some more like woody scents and like pine, um, oh, I forgot what else is in it, okay it's a, spark or it's a blend of sparkling cranberry champagne blood orange with notes of balsam, mandarin and white cedar and it's quite nice might not be to everyone's taste it's one of those scents that it's really a Christmas scent and if you smell it any other time besides Christmas it might be a bit but you kind of imagine yourself at Christmas time kind of cold you got your Christmas decorations out yeah it works <laughs> Anyway, um, I also got um, from eBay from the same seller um, one of the candle holders um, so you can actually put the candle in. I do it my fingers um, and it sits in there, and now you can burn your candle and stuff. So um, I will list the eBay seller down below. They also do lots of Bath and Body Works stuff as well, so you can have a look at them. Um, continuing on with candles, these are from bathandbodyshop.co.uk and again I will put that information down below. Um, and I was telling you earlier about Cranberry Woods, I do have a small one but I loved it so much that I had to get a big one. So this is a three wick. And oh this is just, oh, it's so nice. Um, let's see. A mysterious blend of cranberry, rich blackcurrant and raspberry with notes of cinnamon, bark, cedarwood and warm amber. It's just so nice. It's one of those scents that you could probably burn all year round, but it's particularly nice for the autumn I think. And the next one I got purely because I um, was reading a lot of reviews and um, this one came up a lot as a favourite and um, seemed to go over well with everyone and it's leaves and this one says it's um, golden nectar, juicy mandarin and red delicious apple blended with toasted cinnamon, mulled cider and freshly harvested berries and this smells amazing it's sort of like it reminds me of something but I just can't put my finger on it it's really nice it does have um, a cinnamon scent to it but it's like a sweet light cinnamon it's not in your face it's not overpowering um, this is really nice this this would be nice to burn at Christmas as well um, not just for the autumn but you know all through this time of the year even into like January February time that would be a great scent to, um, to burn um, also from Bath and Body Shop .co .uk. <laughs> Um, I got the Bath & Body Works Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin Antibacterial Deep Cleansing Hand Soap and a little pocket back which is um, the little hand gel type things and Cranapple Crisp <laughs> and I smelt this when I got it out of the box and I really wanted to like eat it because it smells really good it smells like it smells like um like a apple crisp or something like that it smells like a dessert it smells really nice. I like that. I might have to like get a couple more of those ones. That's really nice. Alright, so let's so let's like candles and type of things. Um, also I wanted to get um I was looking for like a black watch because I have a white one 
that has like mother of pearl actually I've got it right here this is not new by the way um, it's by Oasis but it's more of a summery type watch as you can see um, so I wanted something that had um, you know a black strap or something to wear for the winter time so I got this one by Seconda and this was from Very.co.uk as well um, and it's got one of those rubbery um, type straps it's really comfortable but it's just really it's really nice um, it's not in your face quite classy yeah it's really I really like it so yes I'm happy I got that and it was like I think it was like 25 pounds or something but I was looking at other watches that were like um, like branded watches and they were just like 150 to 100 pounds and I'm like what's the way I'm paying that for a watch and, but this one's really nice and I thought 25 pounds is probably not too bad I suppose so yes, I'm happy with it anyway and lastly I got the new Urban Decay Book of Shadows 4 it's massive absolutely massive <laughs> I didn't realise it was going to be this big. Yes, this is just this is just the outer box. Um, you know, it opens up, and the palette is inside. Um, a lot bigger than the other palettes. Um, and ooh, let me open it up. Of course, I don't know if you, you've probably seen these on the web already. Um, but you've got that bit, um, and I'll explain to you a little bit more about it in just a second once I open this up oops and I can just show you that with everything falling out um of course you get your eyeshadows and then there is um let me just set this down try to get this out so I don't drop it a 24-7 liquid waterproof eyeliner in perversion and you also get a mini mascara and this is the super curl curling mascara and it's got um, a plasticky type one but it's you know curved and then you also get a mini um, original primer potion but because these are the new packaging this is this will last you probably like a really long time because you only need a tiny tiny bit of this stuff um, so that's nice and then also it comes with um, this little speaker doohickey thing <laughs> and um, a couple of things you can connect your phone up to now I think I was reading online that it works with any phone providing it has a camera and a web browser so um, I haven't actually tried it yet but I think you plug it in and there's tutorials so that'll be something to try later I suppose um, so yeah interesting I got this one this is from Debenhams um, Debenhams.com or .co.uk I don't know if you're from the UK you'll know just you know it's from Debenhams anyway <laughs> um, and I can't get this back in yeah, uh, there we go. Um, so yeah, I think it was I'm gonna say forty six pounds or something like that. So it's a bit pricier than previous ones have been. And this is so not gonna go back in. All right, I'm gonna have to leave this out because it's hard to get that back in. Um, so yeah. Oh, and as with always, this packaging is a bit weird. Okay. So yeah. Okay. So when I was talking about the phone thing you can open this up and there is I don't know if you can see this there's a bit right here you can set your phone in um, and here's a little information card and you've got um, okay so okay your phone needs a camera and you've got these little things that you take a picture of um, if you have a barcode reader um, most phones are either iPhones or Android and um, you can get apps to read those um, so I'm guessing what you do is you take a picture of you know one of those and it loads up with like a little speaker and comes on your phone and has a um, tutorial. Yes, it says any phone with a browser and a camera can do this. Watch how-to videos for your latest looks on your phone. Okay. 
So yeah, I'll give that a try later and see if it works. Um, I think that's it for now. Nothing else. My boudoir privé box hasn't showed up yet. Um, but as always, as soon as it comes, I'll put a video up. Um, and that is it for now. See you later. Bye.